Hey world, what's good? It's your man True Lyrics again. Um, today I'm going to do my review on the Keith Murray verse Fragile Star Battle. Um, I'm trying to think. Where do I start? Uh, positive notes. It was supposed to be quote unquote a good battle for hip hop. Um artists that were established in the 90s and, and were big names in the 90s coming together in the you know late 2000s battling for the culture of hip-hop um the the thought was good the thought was a very good thought um got a couple things i want to point out there one keith murray really disappointed me um there was points where i don't even know what the hell he was saying i don't even know what if he knew what he was saying, I think Keith Murray was drunk, high, something like I would have been interested to see how that battle would have went if he was sober. I think Fredro won it hands down. I think Fredro was more focused. Um, Fredro had some punchlines. I think Keith had Keith had at certain points he had delivery, but it, I mean it was a horrible battle. It was a horrible battle, like like it just was. Uh, Keith kept saying the same lines over and over and over again like like I, I really think at some point Keith had I think Keith probably had the better game plan but I think Keith probably had a couple one too many to drink and it just yeah it went out the window when it came out for the battle I think it would have been battle it would have been a better battle if they went with no beats if they didn't use beats it would have been a lot better i did like some of it because it kind of gave you that eight mile type feel whatever with the beats but it's a new day you know it's a new day it's a new era and battle rap and they're not using beats now and you know i think they man i'm just glad i didn't pay to be there in the building because it was supposed to be this epic historical moment people paid their money and it's like this is what you got for like we didn't need to pay to see that battle people didn't need the that didn't need to be on paper like like it, it just and i can't even just be mad at them i mean i'm mad at whoever organized it i think it, 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 it wasn't organized right? you got like 30 people on the damn stage you know what i'm saying i, I thought it was kind of hot how they had the refs up there because at one point it looked like they was going to fight it's like yo man y'all grown ass men y'all like in y'all 40s up here like the said in the background, like, we can't be acting like we 18, like we teenagers up here. Like, it's crazy. Um, I'm surprised that Redman wasn't there. Eric Sherman wasn't nobody from Death Squad was there. Like, what the hell? Like, that didn't make no sense to me. I mean, at least Sticky Fingers was there. Sticky Fingers was there for Fredro. I didn't understand why Chief Murray was Dolo. Like, where's your squad at? Where's the Death Squad at? How come these jokers ain't up here supporting you? Like. That battle, it should have it should have been a lot more. I mean, I can't go off of what we've seen on camera, but it definitely should have been more names as far as in the industry and artist wise that should have been in the building somewhere. You know what I'm saying? On either side. I like the fact that they had Lux and Num actually host the battle. I thought that was a good look. I thought that was cool, you know, actually taking um, you know, new new uh, battle rap artists and actually putting them in a position where they are, you know, paying homage to artists that have been around for a while. I thought that was dope. But, um, Keith Murray, man, where the hell was your squad at, man? Where the hell was the death squad at? Like, death squad should have been there. Like, that's unacceptable, man. Like, nobody? Nobody? Like, <clears throat> that was a red flag straight from the rip. And that might have been why Keith Murray got drunk or was high or whatever the hell he was. But Keith M Murray wasn't normal. You know, I think Keith Murray thought it was a show. You know what I'm saying? Like, like we're going to put on a show and and just perform. Like, his shit looked more like a performance. I mean, I have, listen, I'm not a Joe Button fan at all. But I think Joe Button battle was way better. Cassidy battle 100,000 trillion times better so I think the next artist from the 90s or whatever that decides they want to step in that battle ring they better look at the Cassidy shit and and look at what you know what, what to do in these type of battles uh, 
this is worse than the cannabis shit. I mean, yeah, this Keith Murray Frederick Star battle is absolutely 100% worse than the cannabis notebook incident. So, cannabis, thank them because they just saved your life, dog. They just saved your life. They saved your. They, they saved the career that we remember you by. Because this was absolutely horrible. Notebook shit was terrible, but this shit here was horrible. Like, straight horrible. No way around it.